Hey, how's it going, everyone? Saints fan back again with another GTA Online episode of it. Did you know? And today, did you know about two really cool things that you could do in the nightclub? One, being thrown out of the nightclub, and two, actually serving free drinks to your friends. And there's actually a little third one that'll show you guys uh, to save you some money. But the main thing that I found out today, which I thought was hilarious when it happened, was getting kicked out of the nightclub. Now this doesn't work in your own nightclub for obvious reasons. You have to go to a friend's or a friend has to come into your nightclub, but it's really simple to actually happen. All you need to do is walk into your friend's nightclub or have them walk into yours and then have them dance in front of one of the bodyguards or one of the bouncers. You actually have to go into the dance menu. So for a lot of the places you have to hold, I think it's right on the D pad. It's not going to pop up in the top left to, to say dance. You have to just, you know, hold it and it'll start dancing you. You can't do like the interaction menu stuff. None of that seemed to work. But once you start dancing in front of the bouncer, after about like 30 seconds or so, you'll get thrown out. <laughs> and I didn't realize that would happen because I was in my friend's nightclub. So you would think, you know, they'd be uh, more understanding or something i can understand maybe if it was a random person's nightclub but they threw me out and then i was actually temporarily banned from entering his club you can see when i tried to go back in the top left it says you are temporarily banned now i couldn't actually figure out how long this ban was i don't think it actually said i wouldn't expect it would, it'd be more than like i don't know five ten minutes if anyone knows the exact time then you can let me know in the comment section but i thought that was a, a, like a hilarious little thing little easter egg i guess that rockstar put into the club dlc let me know in the comments how many times have you been thrown out of a nightclub now the two other things that have to do with drinks so you can actually walk around in the upstairs bar you can walk around the back and i had no idea about this because my freaking nightclub's so dark i didn't even realize there was a door here but if you look at the mini map it's pretty obvious that there's a door but you can go behind the club or behind the bar and actually go to the right and serve free drinks to your friends all you have to do is go up hit e or whatever it is to serve the drinks and then have your friend walk up to you and they can actually get some free shots. Now, he did tell me that he didn't get to choose anything, so it's just, I guess, random, or it's just like the regular liquor or whatever it is. But he did say after one shot, he was wasted. So if you don't want to buy any of the drinks, if you're in a friend's nightclub, have them go around back and they can give you drinks for free, or you can give them to your friend for free. Now it does run out. I think it only took like two or maybe three and I, I couldn't serve them anymore. But that's another really cool thing that I didn't know about. And then the final thing, the thing that you should never do because it's literally a waste of money. I decided to purchase the $150,000 bottle of champagne. Now, why I have to pay $150,000 for champagne in my own nightclub is beyond me. But I bought it and literally all you can do is shake it up and then spray it everywhere. So if you really think that's $150,000 worth of money... Well, then you can go ahead and do it. But if you're normal, you realize that is a giant waste of money. You should never spend that much money to do that. You don't get anything beneficial out of it. But anyway, that was this week's episode of Did You Know? Hopefully you did not know a few of these things regarding the nightclub. Actually, here's some gameplay of what it looks like when your friend does get thrown out. They just sort of disappear. It's kind of unfortunate. I was really hoping I'd see like my bodyguard or my bouncer actually throw them out but you don't get to see that you just see them disappear and then they yell at you in the chat but yeah if you guys did enjoy and found this video helpful please drop it a like subscribe for these episodes every single saturday and as always i will see you guys in the next one